Almost 40 years to the day of starting as a history professor at WKU, Dr. David Lee stepped into the role of provost, the highest academic administrator at a university. That meant the appointment of a new dean for a college that's celebrating 50 years of existence. In 40 years, I can't exactly call it a meteoric rise, but nevertheless, it's, it's a tremendously exciting opportunity. Dr. David Lee is still adjusting to his new role as university provost after spending 23 years as the dean of Potter College of Arts and Letters. I'm struck, frankly, by how little contact I have with students. I'm in a building where no classes are held for the first time in my career and I don't encounter students in the hallway. For me to generate contact with students, I literally have to generate it. Lee has passed the torch to longtime Potter College Associate Dean, Dr. Larry Snyder. I've been in the office over here for 12 years, so I have some sense of what goes on in the Dean's office, but Potter College has been my home since I got here, since 1990. These transitions come as Potter College marks 50 years since the Board of Regents voted to make it a college. It took the name, obviously, of Potter College for young ladies, which was a small college that was established here on the top of Vinegar Hill, even before WKU was here. Every student that goes through this university, regardless of major, has to come through this college. And so I like to think that we are, are at the heart of, of everything that happens around here, and I'm very proud of that. As for his goals for the future as provost, Dr. Lee says they're virtually the same goals he had when he started his first day of teaching. I think on our best days, our focus is on student success. Uh, success in terms of recruiting those students here, making sure they have a successful experience, and graduating them in a timely fashion. Just before the start of the semester, Dr. Gordon Emsley announced he was stepping down as provost and vice president for academic affairs, a position he held for five years. After a brief sabbatical, Emsley will return to teaching in the Ogden College of Science and Engineering. With this week's View from the Hill, I'm Amy Bingham.